there everybody it has been a little while since my last video which really bums me out because I really wanted to upload every day for the month of January but I kind of fell off a few weeks ago as we got really busy with orders and everything so I thought I'd give you a little update of what I've been up to so on the forest of secrets front I have been working on new customs for forest of secrets I haven't made a ton of progress with the fire hearts or the tiger claws but this is where I'm at so far and Rachel and I have been working on Tiger Claw's design and trying to decide exactly what he should look like. We did both come up with our own designs. This was Rachel's and this was my design. And I think we're going to end up blending the two together a little bit to create a Tiger Claw custom for his final custom. I just recently made a poll asking what color his eye color should be from these different options. I'll show them to you now. Uh, it's kind of like a gold color as a possibility an orange. This is my version. I call it hot dog eyes. I don't know. It's like gold, copper, and green. I think it looks cool, but nobody seems to be digging it. And finally, this really orange one, which seems to be the winner from the poll so far. So that's probably what Tiger Claw is going to end up having. I've also been doing various other polls asking for what color bases of characters design should be to get started on them. And for Fern Cloud, I also asked your guys' thoughts for Spotted Leaf and Broken Tail, and Dust Pelt, and Dark Stripe, and also Cinder Pelt. So yeah, we have started designing new customs for these characters in particular, and they will be available in our Etsy shop as soon as I get their designs finished. This is Cinder Pelt. This one is gonna be Broken Tail. Don't have clouded eyes for him yet, but we will have that as an option. This one's gonna be Dark Stripe, and this is Dust Pelt. And down below we have Fern Kit, and this is Cloud Kit sitting and standing, and Ash Kit. And of course, the magnificent Spotted Leaf. I've always thought it would be fun if Star Clan cats had wings, or at least the important ones had wings. And so we decided to finally shoot our shot and make winged cats. So now we have Spotted Leaf's custom, and her Star Clan version is going to have wings. She's going to be super beautiful and sparkly and everything. And I'm just so excited to design her. So yeah, once I finish this group, I'll have all the customs that I need for Forest of Secrets Episode 7. I am so excited. I have been playing around in Photoshop a little bit, creating backgrounds and stuff for these new episodes. And you can see here that I can now change out the grounds very easily to be like different colors and such for different scenes. And so I've been playing around with this scene of the Gorse Tunnel. I think it'd be super cool for everywhere in Thunderclan's camp to have the Gorse Tunnel because that's around Thunderclan's camp to protect them. And so here's like a side view of the Gorse Tunnel and here is the other side. So yeah, I'm so excited to have the customs be edited in here and have everything just super cool and kind of like its own little stop go animation style. Aside from working on these customs for myself for the Force of Secrets episodes, we've also been working on a lot of customs for Etsy orders. And if you're interested, you can order your very own custom over on our Etsy shop to be delivered to you made by us. Let's check out some of the ones we've been working on recently. These are all of the kitten size customs. We've got Maple Shade, Ivy Pool, some little Barleys, a standing one and a sitting one. This is Bright Heart. Here's Cloud Tail and a bunch of J Feathers. Wow! These are the full size customs. We have a Gray Stripe, a Princess, Raven Paw, and there's a kitten sized tall star kitten that's sitting. So cute. Here is Fire Heart. Here's a little kitten Brambleberry. This is our first chance we've had to make a Brambleberry this season. And she is so adorable. This is a River Clan medicine cat, and she's just so cute. And here is a full size J feather. And finally, on this level, I have two full size J feathers. Here are a kitten holly leaf and a kitten sandstorm. Here is Blue Star in the apprentice size, Squirrel Flight, Fireheart, and Sandstorm, and Cloudtail. So all in all, that is 29 known characters that I have completed so far. So impressed with myself. They're so cute. Yay! So I'm going to have a lot of customs to package up this week. And here are all the characters that I've painted so far that are known characters all together. Which one is your favorite? Comment down below. We currently have some sales running for Valentine's Day couples. So you can check that out over on Etsy. There's a 50% off sale going until Valentine's Day. 
Here are the original characters that I finished so far this week. This one's name is Lucy and they are so cute because they've got hair covering their eyes. This is a first for us for customs, but they are so cool. But they don't even have eyes, they're just beautifully furry and don't even need eyes to look super cool. I love it. This little tiny one is Beauty Spot. It's a little kitten. And look how cool this one turned out. Amazing! We have so much fun creating the OCs. If you'd like to order your very own original character, there'll be a link to order down below. And as for paint your owns, here are some ones that I've been currently working on and that are finished up and ready to ship off very soon. Got some apprentices and kittens here. And here we have some full sizes compared to kitten paint your owns. That look so cool in various poses. And here are the last of the paint your owns. So yes, as you can see, we've been very busy with orders, getting all of these paint your own customs done, as well as all of the known characters and original characters. Now I'm down in the painting section of my office, and these are some ones that currently have base coats that I'm gonna be soon painting the next few details on. And here is a dragon custom. Dragons are new, and this one has just barely started on its base coats, and so excited to see what it turns out to look like. Here is its reference sheet, and it is going to look incredible once it's painted all the way. I'm going to be recording a video of me painting this one, so you can look forward to that video coming out eventually. So yeah, those are some of the things that I'm working on. In addition to, we have three new types of customs available in our Etsy shop. We have furries, winged cats, and dragons. So yeah, we've been pretty busy these last few weeks. Wish us luck on all the projects we're working on. And I hope to be uploading a lot more videos in February. Thanks so much for watching this one. I'll see you in the next video. Till then, bye bye